Hello again and welcome to the Warhammer 40k Morning Glory video and today guys I have a huge mega bunker busting exciting announcement for you because I am officially embarking on my biggest hobby challenge yet and I just I'm, I just, I'm so excited to talk to you guys about this because I think it's going to be absolutely insane. Okay, okay. Okay, Morning Glory, what are you on about? Stop, stop bloody blue balling this Morning Glory. Tell us, what is this hobby challenge? Okay, okay, okay. Well, some of you may know, if you've been catching the live streams or you've been hearing me talk about sort, sort of these things in the background, I've been looking to expand the channel armies. I've been looking to bring more factions onto the channel. And especially I've been looking at those ones that make those classic guard versus something matchups. You know, those classic games. And so I decided that it was time to get some more Xenos on the channel. I've got all of the guard. I've got loads of Black Templars. But, you know, I've got a lot of Imperium factions. But I really don't have enough non imperium even the, the only one xenos faction i actually have in any quantity is my jesus of course and they're really just another kind of human right they're just, they're just totally loyal mining workers for the imperium of course of course right so i thought it was time to have a proper xenos army a proper alien force take on the mordian 50th rifles and i thought you know what you know what let's go for something a little bit different let's go for a little bit different so the other day, I went into Element Games and I was like, you know what? I'm going to pick up some Tyranids. So, this is the, so initially, the first announcement is Tyranids will officially be coming to the Mordian Glory channel. Okay. Now, I know if you're going to be saying, oh, Mordian Glory, great, you went in to, to Element Games and bought yourself a, a combat patrol. Oh, woo, woo, what a, what a big announcement. But wait, because you know what? You can't have one combat patrol. Gotta have one combat patrol. What? It's just so lonely. Look, it's all sat there all alone. We need more than one combat patrol. So you know what? I went in and I was like, you know what? You know what? How about two combat patrols? I mean, if, if it's good once, if it's if anything that's uh, nice once, it's gotta be nice twice. I mean, that's just like the rule, right? That's just like science. And I was looking at these two book combat patrols, and I was like, you know what? You get quite a lot of termagants in here, don't you? I, I quite like the idea of Having a bit of a swarm army, you know. I've got I've got a swarm lord for one of these hive types. I can have a you know a winged hive time for the other one. A few warriors, you know, a few you know, sixty or so uh, terminals. This is a good start, but it's not enough. It's not enough. Because so I thought, you know what, we need to expand. We need more bugs. So I, you know what, let's get some termagants. Let's get some more termagants. But you know what's better than one? Extra box of termagants. Two extra boxes of termagants. Two. But you know what's better than two boxes of termagants? Three more boxes of termagants. Three more boxes of termagants, guys. <laughs> now we've got. Now we're getting places. Now we're getting places. You know. Now we're like, okay, we've got sixty odd in the. Uh, in, in the start collecting sets. And then we've got another 60 here. We've got 120 bucks. That's pretty ambitious. That's pretty ambitious. But you know what? I don't think it's enough. I don't think it's enough. I think we need more. I think we need more. So I decided... Let's go for another... Let's go for another... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine boxes of Termigants. That's right. Another nine boxes of Termigants. Because, you know, that that now gives us a solid number. Now we're looking at 240 termagants. 240 little bugs. Two hive tyrants. And we've also got six boys. And then we've got enough ripper swarms in here to sink a battleship. But you know what? You know what? This makes me sad. This makes me sad. Because we've got all these little bugs. And we've got all of these... You know, we've got these hive tyrants, and we've got these warriors, you know, we've got the little bugs, and we've got the big brothers, and we've got the big daddies with the hive tyrants, but, you know what, I think these, I think these termagants need the mama. I think they need the mama, so you know what, let's go for a termagant, let's go for a termagant, Tyrannifax, Tyrannifax slash termagant, let's go for a termagant, boom, but you know what, you know the rule guys, if one is good, then Having it twice is very nice. I said that before. 
So we've got another, another Termigan. That's right. We have got 240 Termigans. Enough Ripper Swarms for me to build like 20, 30, 40 Ripper Swarms. We've got six Warriors, two Hive Tires, and two Termigans. The Eternity Swarm list is coming to the time. I mean, just look at all this stuff, guys. Oh, my God. I can't even lift. It's all going to fall over if I lift up. Oh, my God. Two Combat Patrols, 14 Boxes of Termigans, two Tyrannifexes slash Termigans. My, my, my. Oh, my God. Now, this alone would be a pretty big announcement. I mean, let me just tell you guys. Let me just tell you. you it, the look on the guy's face in Element Games, and I was like, do you, uh, do you have any more Tyranids? And he was like, he saw that I had like the Combat Patrol and, and like three boxes of Termigans in my hand. He's like, yeah, how many do you have? And I was like, well, how many, how many more boxes of Termigans do you have? And he was like, uh, I'll have to check the, com I'll have to check. And he checked the computer. He was like, uh, we've got like uh, another 11. And I was like, great, I'll take them. And he was like, oh, wait, how many? I was like, all of them. <laughs> The guy's like, I'm going to have to go down to the warehouse and get them. I was like, that's fine. That's fine. It was like that scene in Parks and Rec when Ron Swanson was like, bring me all of the termagants you have. It's like, wait, what I'm afraid you heard was bring me a lot of termagants. But what I actually said was bring me all of the termagants you have. <laughs> So I I literally bought every fucking box of Termigans that they had. I got the extra combat patrol, and I thought that's all a couple of Tyrannic effects on the shelf. I thought you can't have a Nid swarm list without the ability to spawn more Nids. Now this this alone is the big. So we're collecting Nids. We've gone all in on turning swarm list. But wait, there's more. There's more because I have set myself a personal hobby vow, a personal hobby challenge. Well, I am going to get this entire army built and painted by the end of the month. So I got I got this army on the 1st of Feb. I, it's good, that will give me 28 days to build and um, build and paint every single model that you see here. <laughs> but wait, but wait, there's more. <laughs> Because I'm officially announcing that I will be doing a 24-hour painting challenge. To make a dent in all of these little bugs, I am going to be painting for 20... I'm going to be painting as many termigans as I have with the aim of getting all 240 done in a single 24-hour constant live stream. That's right, I'm going to live stream the whole thing. I'm going to record the whole thing as well so I can upload the footage afterwards. It's going to be a massive Termigan Bonanza. I will need to pay 10 Termigans an hour for 24 hours to be able to complete that. <laughs> now, this 24-hour paint challenge is going to be taking place on the 17th of Feb. That's Friday, 17th of Feb, and it will be starting at 10 a.m. UK time, and it will be continuing to 10 a.m. on the Saturday. So it's going to be... It's going to be... <laughs> it's going to be a slog... Do you guys think I can do it? Let me know down in the comments section. Do you think I can get all 240 done in, in, in 24 hours? I mean, it, 10, 10 an hour doesn't sound so bad. Now, I know some people are going to be curious what color scheme I'm going to be going for. I am going to be painting these up in the classic Kraken color scheme. It's the color scheme that you can see on the back there. That one there with the red and the tan. That is what we're going to be going for. Because when I was when I was a but a wee lad, when I was a conscript in the youth battalions, I loved the Kraken Toast. Tyranids were, you know, and, and the Kraken colour scheme, that's what I grew up on as a kid. So we're going to be hitting that nostalgia hard. We're going to be having all the rose-tinted glasses. And, uh, and then also... Uh, a little, little side note, but my favourite, my favourite uh, tipple is actually crack and rum. So it's like crack and rum, nostalgia hit, boom! And of course, we probably will be drinking some crack and rum whilst we're painting Kraken in the twenty-four hour, uh, twenty-four hour live stream. So it's gonna be pretty mad, boys! Oh my god, it's gonna be crazy! It is gonna be absolutely mad. Now, um, I probably will be using like contrast paint for this to make it a little bit easier, just to let you guys know. Yeah, if I tried to paint this old school, I, I think I'd struggle to get to like a squad in 24 hours so we're going to be slapping the contrast on we're going to be doing it in classic crack and color scheme we're going to be paying for 24 hours 17th of feb 
it should be pretty exciting. And that gives me more time, you know, the remaining days outside of outside of the 17th of Feb to try and get the Tyrannifex is built and painted, the Hive Tower is built and painted, the Warriors, and of course the Rippers as well. Guys, this is pretty mad. I'm not going to lie. Let me know what you think down in the comment section, of course. I also don't want to get you guys too excited, although many of you are going to be lying there going, Morning, stop! I can only get so erect! But this may be only the first wave because we've got the termagants here, but I think we probably need some hormigons as well. So there, this is not this is not the first or last we are going to see of the it's maybe the first, but it's not the last that we're going to see of this mad tyranid high fleet challenge. But what I do want to ask one other thing is. Whilst I am painting them up in Kraken colours, I am absolutely open to suggestions for what we should call the Hive Fleet. I'm open for all sorts of kind of cool suggestions. So, obviously, uh, let me know what your name suggestions are down in, down in that comment section below. All right. And that's all for now, guys. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you think. Uh, do, do you think I can do it? But that's all. Hope you enjoyed today's video. And, of course, as always, I'll see you guys next time.